Um, super, this one is live. We are live, we're live. Deadly, 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 and we're live. Brilliant, 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 brilliant. Hope everybody is feeling great. We're just after making scones. They turned out fab, right? fab, 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 fab. Super, the dogs are with us today. This is our lovely dogs. Um, oh, a few things before we start today. Today, I want the kids to go get something they can lift, or the parents or the grown-ups, something that you can lift as a set of weights. We my are just using. My girls are using a, 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 a tin of beans. This is the tin of beans. So take your time, you've got loads of time. Get yourself a tin of beans if they are there, or something you can lift. A tin of beans is half a kilo. It's 400 grams in a kilo, in a, a tin of beans. So it's not, it's not short of half a kilo. So today, we are mixing it up. We're introducing some weights. And uh, take your time and go get yourself a can of beans or something like that. The other thing I wanted to remind you and tell you, at the end of this, I was in the shed there not long ago and uh, saw my wetsuits. Um, really, really useful tip. We live outdoors all summer, so we spend our summer camping. This is true. So we, we literally sleep in a field for the whole summer. Um, so we do lots of outdoor adventures. And we are really into that wild kind of living. So um, I want to do show you the wetsuits that we have because I think it'll be really useful for lots of people today. Um, Instagram, I'll actually do an Instagram video on its own for that. Um, but the um, Facebook, stay on at the end. I'll show you the wetsuits we have. Um, that might be of value to some people. So um, getting wetsuits for the Irish summer is golden. It means it is stay in the sea, in the river for a lot longer. So stay in touch at the end of this and I'll show you that. Grab your beans and we'll get going or your set of weights and we'll get going. How does that sound? Hope everybody's scones worked out. Amazing, amazing. We weren't on the Insta with the scones because you know, you know. Super, so uh, let's get ready to rock. Uh, let's see. Hi Donna, we're ready to go separate. I oh, know that's the Egan's. I couldn't see the name but I know it's the Egan's. Are my two ready? Yeah. Right, let's hope that the do our dogs are just divine. Uh, this is our dog, so we're going to show you our dog. We have two of okay. these. We have two of these, look. Oh, oh, double trouble. double trouble. We have two dogs and they are just fab. They come They're everywhere hard. with us. They go everywhere with us. They come They're camping with us. They go everywhere. This one has an ear infection, so she's a little bit shook. Um, so we only put the dogs away every day because sometimes they bark as the neighbours pass. One of our neighbours. Yes, it's one of yeah. the territory. One of the, yeah, it's a territory. So the dogs are out with their bed today. So if, so if they start barking, sure, look, it is what it is. Right, it is what it is. Super. So lads, let's warm up, yes? Uh, the rhymes are in from Leash. Brilliant. So come here, stay tuned at the end, and I'll show you about your... Um, I'll show you about my wetsuits. I have them left out, out the back for you there. Because um, I actually think that's a really useful tip. Okay, lads, we start with our warm-up. We always jump side to side. We are using a tin of beans today or a set of weights, whatever you happen to have. And let's get the lads and the kids and the grown-ups and everybody starting to push a bit of weight here now. So, um, oh yeah, 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 one more thing, one more thing before we work out. I got, no seriously, I got the most beautiful letter today from Sinead Costello, all the way. Sinead, I know you're from Kerry. Love your writing, it's so nice. Amazing handwriting, Sinead. Amazing, amazing, amazing. So grateful, so thankful. I thought your, your letter warmed my heart now, really special. I'm going to keep that as our little secret um, because that's a special letter that I love, I love, I love. This is the last week, I'm taking letters all the way in. Um, get them in and I'll come visit your school in September. Girls, are you ready? What do we start warming up with? Try! Side to side jumps, yes? Side to side jumps, let's get those body warm. 20 seconds in three, two, one. We say try, let's go side to side. Brilliant. So everybody's here is working super hard. You don't need to keep shouting because the kids at home need to hear what I am saying. Try! Don't have me absolutely murder you. Then, side to side jumps. As you get your rhythm going, make those jumps bigger. Three, two, one. We jog on the spot. We jog on the spot. So we are going to lift a little bit of weight today. We're warming up 20 seconds each exercises. Each exercise, exercises is not a word. Then, squats are next. In five, four, three, two, one. One, squat for me. <coughs> yes, brilliant stuff. Squat down, bend those legs. My legs are so sore from my class this morning. Yes, so any parents, 
I am teaching light classes for people who are used to training. Five seconds to go. Leg curls are next. Three, two, one, and they are off the charts. Amazing. Amazing. Oh, you... like burpees. Huh? I like your burpees. No leg curls. Burpees are next. Don't worry. Burpees are next. Brilliant. Your job right now is to flick your heels to your butt. Flick your heels all the way to your butt. Burpees in four, three, two, one. Burpees. Brilliant. Brilliant. Burpee for me now. Super. Keep working and keep tipping away. Great to have everyone there. Super, super. Lindsay Dunn. The other Lindsay Dunn. I have a sister, Lindsay Dunn, and there's another Lindsay Dunn is watching. It's the other Lindsay Dunn. Yes, hello from Aoife. Great to have her. Three, two, one. Circle those shoulders for me now. Circle those shoulders. The body would feel a little out of breath. That happens during the warm up. Get ourselves ready to go. Circle those shoulders. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Super, super. Four, three, two, and one. Now bring it forward for me. Super, bring it forward, lovely. So today's class, we're gonna lift the can of beans. We're gonna start putting some weight in it there. Are you ready? Three, two, one. Now take it bigger circles backwards. Super. So we're going to do a little bit extra stretch today. Yeah, because we are lifting a little bit of weight. So it's our first class lifting some weight, which is exciting. Yeah, in my other classes, we lift loads of weights. I lift loads and loads of weights. Four, three, two, and one. Now take it forward the other direction. Try to keep your arms nice and straight so that you can mobilize this ball and socket joint that is your shoulders. Yes, four, three, two, and one. Ali, teach your exercise. Come on, we can see that. Squat yeah. down, turn to the side, squat down, and stand. Girl, down, side, down, stand. Down, stand. I mean, this side, down. Good side. girl. Down, side, down, stand. Okay. Down, side, Two more, right? down, stand. Down, side, down, stand. One more. Down, Good girl. side, down, Super, stand. super, super. Min, you going to do yours? Okay, Min is going to do hers. Good girl. We're going to stretch our groins now. Count us for four. Three, two, one. Change. Four, three, two, one. Change. Four, three, two, one. Change. Four, three, two. Okay, and two more times. Change. Four, three, two, one. Change. Four, three, two, one. Well done to my two because they're teaching hundreds of kids. You can teach more. And you can teach more. I'll give you more exercises for tomorrow. So well done to my kids. Right, you're going to start by grabbing your can of beans or your weight. You can use two bottles of water. You can use salt. You can use whatever. Whatever you have at home. If you don't have anything, just don't worry. You can use the remote controls. Anything you have, no panic about not having, you know, not having stuff. Even your no pencil panic. case. Your pencil case, anything, yes? So grab your cans of beans, my two. Hello, why do you choose beans? Because beans are uh, because that's what's, in, that's what's in the press. Why do I choose beans? It's because of what's in the press. Yes? Right, we are going to take those weights, right? I'll grab my weights. Look at the size of the weights I lift. These are my weights. Woo! Uh, yes? <laughs> These are my weights. So your job, you're going to put those weights up on your shoulder. Your elbows are going to come forward now, right? And what you're going to do is squat down and stand okay this is the exercise we're going to do it for 40 seconds right so i'm going to teach you how to do this exercise for 40 seconds is everybody ready in three two one now squat down squat you hear me breathing out as we stand we breathe yes yes try squat squat Deadly. So now as you bend your little legs, I need your chin to lift up a little. So lift your chin a little as your bum goes down. You squat. 15 seconds. Keep the weights on your shoulders. So while we put the weights on our shoulders, now my whole body is underneath that weight. Squat. Five seconds. So a different class today. Three, two, one. Now shake your legs out because your legs have done the work. So there's no jumping. There's no burpees, there's no anything today. The next exercise we're going to do is take your weights, start them in front of your thighs, lift them to the side and lower. Are you ready? In four, three, two, one. Lift your weights from your, from your thighs to your shoulders and back down. Grab your weights up, up, 
and down. So when we go up, our fingernails are facing downwards, right? So my back is nice and straight. Try straighten your arms. Come on now, concentrate. And lower down. So lift it up and lower down. Lift it up and down. And lower down. 15 seconds. So lifting weights give you, gives you a lovely muscle tone and actually it's really good for strength and helping increase the strength of your back, the strength of your core. Five seconds, keep lifting. Three, two, one. Leave down the weights. You might want to stretch out your arms. Take your arms across like this, and I'll show you the next exercise. The next exercise we're going to do, yeah, the next exercise that we're going to do is with your weights in your hand, I want you to lunge forward and lunge back. Are you ready? Let's go in three, two, one. Weight by your side. Now step forward, now as you come up, step forward, now bend those legs, those legs are bend, down, down, yes, and now keep your shoulders back, so you've got to put your chest out, really proud, now you've got a big pair of boobs, yeah, yes, 20 seconds, so keep your shoulders back, excellent work, excellent, 10 seconds to go here, really good, Super nice, super simple. Yes, bend those legs. Five seconds, four, three, two, one, Brilliant. In between, look, you can stretch your legs. You can stretch your legs just like this. Grab your foot in your hand. I know you've seen this a trainer. The next one we're going to do is bicep curls. You're going to curl the weights to your shoulders and lower back down, yes. Five seconds, are you ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Curl up, come on, it's training time. Up you go, so all the way to your shoulders, and then lower the weights right down by your side. All the way up, and lower back down. Now breathe out. Yes, now I wanna make sure at the bottom that you're not doing tons of swinging. So the weights stop at your legs, and then you go again. Yes, good stuff, good stuff. Brilliant. Amazing work, amazing work, amazing work. Super. 10 seconds to go here. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Yes. Super. And rest. Next, what you're going to do is keep your weights where they are, right? You're going to step to the side. Look, one leg is bent, one leg is straight. Come back to the center. Step and center, but you have 10 seconds, okay? Yeah. Are you ready? Five seconds. Three, two, one. Let's go. Try. 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 Bend one leg and come back. Now my girls need to stay focused and not go near the dogs. Yes, the dogs are quiet. Yes? Dogs may make no noise, you make no noise. Yeah, as long as you stay away from the dogs, everybody will survive this workout. Yeah! Yes, side lunge. Side lunge is tricky, right? Mm -hmm. Uh huh. 20 seconds to go. So today's class, totally brand new, totally different. Your legs will feel a little sore tomorrow. You really need to see me pop in into the inside and out again. Huh? You just yeah, need to pop in and out the inside. That's okay. Seven seconds to go. Brilliant stuff. Brilliant, brilliant stuff. Three, two, one. Super. E rest. Watch your screens. What you're going to do is catch your can of beans, push it up, take it down. Go with the other side up and take it down. Ten seconds, okay? And I'll talk you through. How are you finding the weight? Easy. Yeah, good. Three, two, one. Let's go. Right hand one at a time and down. Now, as we breathe, go up, we breathe out. Take it down. Take it down. Super, super. So you don't need to lift heavy at the start. Good stuff. 20 seconds. So when I start, my fingernails are pointing towards my ear. When I push up, my fingernails are facing the front. So you're facing your device, yes? 10 seconds to go. Brilliant stuff. Five seconds here. Four, three, two, and one. You guys know push-ups. Your next exercise on the plan today is push-ups. You can come onto your toes, bend down, and exhale up, or on your knees, bend down, and exhale, and up we go. Yes. Are you ready? Three, two, one, push-ups. Let's go. Now with the push-ups, your boobs must come down to the ground. And they're called boobs, so 
boys and girls. Right, boobs for boys and girls. Great stuff, great stuff. Super lads, keep working hard now. Bend those elbows, boobs to the ground and all the way back up. Remember when we're starting, yeah, starting, stay on your knees because knees push-ups are super hard. Yeah, knees ones are super hard. You're almost done round one. You're not knackered. If you keep telling yourself you're knackered, you're knackered. Yes, let's go. Six seconds to go. Brilliant stuff. Three, two, one. Now take your arms above your head this time and do a tiny stretch. Pushing the palm of your hand down the back of your of your back, down in between your shoulder blades. Oh, I feel the stretch there. Yeah, that's where you feel the stretch. I know, you feel the stretch and change. Brilliant stuff. Change. Super. Super, super, super. Oh, no, right. Now this time with the hands, take your hands up and twist your thumbs down and back. Arms must stay straight, so we're giving the biceps a nice stretch. And guys, all you gotta do is do it one more time and you're done. We start with squats. Yes, are you ready? Grab your weights, we start with squats. Load the we load the beans up on your shoulders. That sounds a bit mad, doesn't We're it? just side Huh? Oh, it's not just behind. Squats. Up. Yeah. I thought you were telling the sound there. No, that was just a stretch. Try by the way. Okay, yeah. Can you put those weights on your shoulders? Leave the beans up there. Yes. And as we get fitter and stronger, we can increase the, what we pick up. Yeah, so this is half a kilo. A can of beans is 400 grams. And there's 500 grams in a kilo. So we're almost at half a kilo. 420. A bag of gosh. sugar is one kilo. Yeah. 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 Thousand grams in a bag of sugar. You need a lot of bag of sugar. No, you just need one bag of sugar for each arm. Yes, yeah, five seconds to go. Three, two, one rest. 20 seconds. We lift to the side again next. Yes. Up and lower. Up and lower in 10 seconds to go. So today, today's class is all about strength and conditioning and weights and amazing, amazing, amazing. Hi to the right. You ready? Three, two, one. Are you ready? Up and take it down. Now as we lift and lower down. Yes. And lower down. Super, 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 super. Yes. So straight after class, I'll sit on Facebook Live, I'll talk you through wetsuits. Not that I'm an expert, I don't tell you what we have and what we find useful from years of sleeping in the field. My kids don't know what it's like to be in a hotel. <laughs> Amazing. You find yes. so exciting. 10 seconds to go. Now as you lift the weights, you still want your fingernails facing downwards, right? So my hands don't turn. Yes, three seconds, two and one. Now stretch your arms, take your arms across your body. Yep. When we go to a head, and when we go to a change, hotel, it's like Disneyland. It's like Disneyland for my lads. A whole it's time. so fun though. Yes, grab your weights, we lunge. We lunge. Well, you know, three, two, one, step forward, step forward, breathe out. Breathe, step forward and breathe out. Yes, step. Mill, can you put the weights down by your side? So hang the weights down by your side. You gotta keep your shoulders back now. Yeah, super. Brilliant. So it is really good, 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 good skill. It's really important we get kids to lift the weights because we don't train them or anything but weights. We stick a school bag on their back, which is a couple of kilos, and we send them off to walk. You know, so let's have a think about that. Eight seconds, yes, bend those legs, beautiful lunges here. Beautiful, shoulders back, three, two, one, stretch your legs. Take your hand in your foot. Foot in your hand. <laughs> hand in your foot. Oh, yes. Brilliant stuff, brilliant stuff. Bicep curls are next. You're going to take the weights to your shoulders and lower back down. Eight seconds. Where are we going? Right now. Three, two, one. Then you curl the weights up. Lower back down. Now as we lift, we breathe out. So you got to tuck your elbows Hi. in. Tuck your elbows in now. So your elbows are not going really far out. Super. So curl that weight up and lower that weight down. Super. So today's class is totally different. Uh, no jumping, no, you know, it's a different class, really important for us to do the strength. And I'm so delighted that we're at this stage that we can introduce the weights, which is amazing. 10 seconds to go. 10 seconds to go. Fantastic, lads. Fantastic. Yes, three, two, one. You guys rest 
stretch your arms above your head. You know, the one reaching your arms, right, with yeah. your hands right between your shoulder blades. Yeah, off you go. Side lunges next, yeah. Okay, side lunges next. Good, change arms, you two. Super, five seconds, everyone. Ready, grab your weights. Three, two, one. Now step to the side and step back. Step to the side. Now you need to take a good big step, right? A good decent step. Yeah, yeah. Brilliant. So remember, we are going to be here, um, definitely here till June, definitely here till then. So my job is then to um, progress and develop and challenge your fitness. So that's why we're adding in the weights, we're adding in the progressions. Super. And I keep mixing in the yoga as well. So try your best to get here as often as you can. Yeah. As long as you're being active, I never mind what you're doing. Five seconds to go. Three, two, one. Brilliant. Brilliant stuff. Brilliant stuff. Super. If you need to stretch your groins, you can do the stretch that Mimi teaches at the start. Change sides and change sides. Two more exercises to go. Yeah, two more. You're going to push the weights up. Take the weights down, push the weights up, take the weights down. Are you ready, lads? Three, two, one, let's go. 40 seconds. And starting at 40 seconds is actually really challenging. Try. So, yeah, good girl, Mizzy. Try. So to be lifting a weight for 40 seconds is an amazing achievement. Don't undervalue how, how difficult it is, how hard you're pushing, because it's really top, top work. Really top work, yes. 17 seconds here, let's go. Brilliant, 15 seconds. Your next exercise and your last exercise is push-ups. That went super quick today. Five seconds here, come on. Three, two, one. Amazing. Push-ups are your last exercise, yes? Last exercise, lads. It's really good going. Serious tough training, serious tough. 10 seconds. Amazing session, 30 minutes, really hardcore. Really challenging, really difficult. Yeah. Are you ready? Three, two, one. Let's do our push up. Now remember, chest down. Up you come. So you have got to push. Now, as we push up, you hear me breathe? Down we go. Reap. Ali, that's an amazing improvement. Well done, men. Well done, girls. 20 seconds. Amazing. Keep working now. Keep pushing hard. Super. I mean, this is phenomenal. Like, look at the side. Yeah, amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Ten seconds to go. Really amazing sessions there. First introduction with the weights. Yes. Three, two, one. Tribe. Tribe. Amazing. Now, today, we do have to do a full stretch. Let's go. Up you come. I want you to take your hands down between your shoulder blades. Gently push down, allowing the palms to slide all the way down your back. Tuck your chin down just a notch and tell yourself, I am amazing. I am amazing. Yep. Yeah. Actually, this time you have to say, I am amazed balls. I am amazed balls. Excellent. Excellent. Now take your hand all the way across the front of your body. Don't push on your elbow joint though, because that pushes your elbow backwards. You don't go backwards. Going backwards means backwards. Yeah, amazing, amazing, amazing. Super stuff, super stuff. And if you want to know about the wetsuits, and like I said, I'm not an ex a wetsuit expert, but I am a stay in the sea as long as you can expert. And I'm also the coldest human on the planet. Absolutely fantastic. Take your feet, what, your right foot in your right hand, keeping your knees together. Maybe you need to balance off something. If you need to balance, hold the wall. Or stare at a point on the floor can sometimes help as well. Knees together and pull all the way back up. Super. I'll do an Instagram story on the wetsuit so you guys are, are good to go. But Facebook, I'll stay there. I have the wetsuits out um, because I was in the shed when they came. To, because I was in the shed and they came into my vision, I was like, wetsuits. I did a post ages ago, but it's a, especially now because you need time. You need a few weeks to get them delivered. Yeah, your last stretch. Point both feet forward, right? Both feet in the same direction. So both feet in the same direction. Oh, now, yeah, of course it hurts. Stretches your calf. Push forward, and your back heel stays in the ground. Try to get your back heel on the ground oh, as you lean you forward. That? Where do you feel it? Ah, lean okay. forward, lean forward. Look how tight your body is. Good, good, good. This stretches your calf. Yes. 
Ow. Just change legs. Oh, that's really sore. I see it behind my um, thing. I feel, I feel, I feel it behind my knee. Yeah, that's your calf. Your calf muscle connects under your foot. I feel it all. Yes, yeah, good, good, good. And all the way into the back of your leg it's up here. It. Yeah, that's your calf muscle. Ow. Super. Yeah, yeah, good, good. I'm glad I found your sore spot. Absolutely um, amazing. We're going to go more for everybody working out today. Uh, for Instagram, I will do the um, wetsuit as a story. See you later. Bye bye. Yes, stay with me here. Stay with me here. Okay, one sec. One sec. Uh, thanks, Donna, for that. You're welcome. Okay, one sec. So, like I said, I'm not a wetsuit expert. I am staying outside for ages expert. Let me just turn you around. Right, I took out the wetsuits out of the shed for you. Um, look at them. They're here. They're here yeah. on the table. They're, they're on the table tennis table, which we bought for 40 euros on done deal and it looked a state and we painted it, and we, we, it we as in me, we yeah. painted it and we bought a new net and look it's the Dan and it folds up and it's outside. Are we really doing Definitely the an amazing thing to buy on keep an eye on done deal. Right so come here let me talk wetsuits to you for a second right um we do spend hours in the sea right um it is really important that you buy a decent old wetsuit so that they can stay in the sea so nice. and stay aid. This wetsuit I purchased for Ali when Ali was obviously that size. This is in my house four years, right? So you want to buy wetsuits that are going to last years. Wetsuits have to fit them. There's no point in buying a wetsuit that's too big or it's um it's function doesn't work, right? So how a wetsuit works is that the water gets trapped between the wetsuit and the layer of a kid's skin. And then the, the kid's body heat heats up the water and it acts as like a hot water bottle. But if the wetsuit is not fitting them, it doesn't create that suction and it, they don't work, right? So first thing you need to do is make sure a wetsuit fits them. The next thing that you need to think of is the width of them. Um, so wetsuits will come in three mil, Al, could you open that because I'm holding this. Wetsuits will come in, I just want to see, it's wrote on this one. It comes on the Mine tag. It comes on the tag, I'm just trying to locate it for you here. Here's the tag. Uh, no, one sec, this wetsuit it was wrote on it, as far as I know, as far as I remember. So, sorry, on the wetsuits, sorry Al, you're my, my dead way. On the wetsuits, right, wetsuits come in two mils, three mils, four mils, and five mils, right? It says it there. Sarah, I knew it said it somewhere. Right, so this wetsuit here is the latest one I bought for Ali in Decathlon. This is by far a superb quality wetsuit for the price. So this came in Decathlon. I got this in Decathlon when I was leaving France last year. Decathlon do online delivery. And I know Decathlon is open in Ireland and obviously that got delayed with COVID, but you will get them online. This wetsuit is 4.3 millimeters, which is really thick but really movable, right? So Al can get around in that. And this shows that, look, she will get two hours in Irish, in the Irish Sea, Ali would last two hours playing, right? So this is a 4.3 mil wetsuit. That one is from Decathlon. The key to buying a wetsuit is number one, it fits, and number two for the kids, a zip in the back. This wetsuit, I made a mistake. I bought this one online. It was a superb, high quality wetsuit. The mill of it again was 4.3. The mistake was that we bought this over the head. So the, the kid slips into it and then they pull this over the head and it seals and it stays. The quality of this wetsuit, this was an expensive wetsuit. But I didn't wetsuit. like this part. Ali didn't like Because you had part. to like squeeze it down over your head. Okay, Al didn't like that part of this, right? So I would never buy a wetsuit that came over the head. It did seal in amazing um, in terms of quality, in terms of brand, it was superb. In terms of keeping her warm, it was superb, but we could never get that good. She wouldn't, she was anxious and wouldn't let us over the head, right? This O'Neill's one that I bought, this was Ali's first proper wetsuit and Millie is still using this, right? This one was three mil, I think. Yes, yeah, so look, this one was 3.2 mil, I can see it here. Here. I bought this in the shop in Tremor. It was my first wetsuit and I kind of wanted to make sure it fit. Look at it. It's still on the go. It's still probably going to do Millie this summer, which will be my fifth summer. So I went from Ali to Millie. Three mil will keep them warm. Now, the other thing worth thinking of for Ireland are these shoe boots. These are, rocks. yeah, like for the stones and the rocks here. These are light wetsuits again, um, where they will trap the water and keep them warm. They, our lads ones don't fit perfect. Um, it didn't really, it, it makes a difference obviously, but I bought ours with a little bit of room in them. Um, the best thing with those is it keeps the water in, or keeps the heat in, but more importantly, they can, like, they can go on the rock pools, they can stand, um, you know what I mean? They can, they can 
getting in and about on in in like stony they can climb back up in the walls and bomb off again so the best value best quality so far that i've seen so far is decathlon um O'Neill's and this rip curl were really expensive. They were about 150 euros each. This decathlon one was 70 and is absolutely the bee's knees um, in terms of wetsuits. Uh, my own wetsuit that I have was one I bought for a triathlon years ago. Um, a tri wetsuit is not ideal for the Irish. Like, it's not ideal because they kind of can rip. Um, so if I was going again and if I had... Um, you know, if I had a few bob, I would just buy one of the decathlon ones. Um, I do have summer wetsuits for the lads as well. Um, the summer wetsuits, sorry. Like eight euros. Summer wetsuits I got from decathlon. Uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Wait one sec. I should have had this out. I should have been thinking ahead, but I wasn't. Um, so my summer wetsuit is from decathlon. Um, this is this one. Uh, so I did buy the summer ones, the, tr the short ones as well. Um, we would use those on a sunny day in Ireland because I'm a cold creature. And look, I like getting into the sea and having, you know, getting to enjoy it. So these ones, this one is inside out. This is from Decathlon. I think this one was about 15 quid. And it is probably um, two mil in, in um, width. Again, you want them to fit. So if I was to offer any advice for someone who lives in a field for the whole summer, legit, legit live in the summer, um, I would buy a decathlon wetsuit. Um, I would definitely go a minimum of three mil for Irish sea um, to keep the kids warm. And then if you wanted, but I don't, you don't necessarily need it. The short ones you'd only use if the weather got really good here. Um, but the long ones, the kids will stay for, the kids will stay, hours in it right so we'd often have the swimming towels under it and then if they get too hot they can strip down half of it do you know what I mean? and the other thing when it comes to wetsuits is you need a you need baby powder right so to get in and out of wetsuits the trick is baby powder so um just sprinkle when the lads are dry uh, throw the baby powder on their feet and the wetsuit will slip on and do, what do i do for the baby powder when we're coming out of them um no i use the baby powder then uh, you untie it and put it down a rack do I? Well, the baby powder is the trick for getting the wetsuits on. And then when you get out of the sea to keep them good, right? If you've been in the sea, you need to rinse off the salt off them to keep them in good nick. So just give it a rinse with, with hot water or warm water and that will take the salt out of them, hang them up and let them dry. So, um, you know, for 70 quid, like 70 quid wetsuit for Ali now. Ali will get this summer, la the end of last summer, and this summer, and probably next summer if she doesn't grow too much. And then that will go on to Millie. So you're talking 70 bob, which you're talking four years. And you are talking, like my lads, we get in in the winter. So we've been in, if, if this wasn't locked down now, we would be probably in the sea now. We would have definitely gotten in the sea um, by this stage every year. So um, for 70 to 80 euros, it's an amazing investment. Uh, think of the shoe boots, that will save you a lot of hardship as well. Um, you can get gloves, we never use the gloves, um, but you can get them. So come here. There you go. Here's a bit of my uh, my outdoor living for you. And uh, I might do as well, I'll try to do a post on cool campsites that we've been to um, now that everybody's going to be holiday in Ireland this year. Uh, I might do that post. We spend an awful lot of time out and about and travelling around. Clara Lara is pretty good. Clara Lara is an amazing, actually amazing, amazing it's a place. water park, but it's like it's, ropes and stuff. It's it's a, Clara and Lara was absolutely the most, the most deadly outdoor, harmless fun. It's swinging off ropes, jumping into rivers. and um, The entrance fee was incredibly cheap. And uh, you, you, there is some stuff you pay for, but we never do the pay stuff. Not that we're scabby, but we just find the free stuff way more fun. And there's huge slides. Huge slides, like but that was two euros off. a pop, so we didn't do the two euros. Mm -hmm. um, but Clara Lara in Wicklow was a really good spot to go. Anyway, right, I better go and uh, get all the work I did you done. Um, see you tomorrow. tomorrow. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye, bye, bye. bye. bye.